Well, hello everybody, Laguna back here for one more Half-Life session uh, today. We have finished uh, Riding Shotgun, which was probably one of the most annoying sequences I've ever had to do because of that stupid gnome falling out of the stupid car. Trying not to swear. Good luck with that, it's gonna... It's gonna happen. Trying not to swear there. So we're in under the radar. We still have <laughs> you weren't kidding. no Mio. We'll be back on the road in no time. Yes, we will. Well, that could be a problem. No, we won't. You hear that auto gun going off out there? We normally run supplies out of the White Forest base, but a few days ago the combine cut off access. Okay. So in other words, you want us to take care of that auto gun. Hmm. Stop that. What do you think, Gordon? I think whoa. Maybe while I'm getting the car fixed up, you can see about clearing up that roadblock. Maybe. All the fresh zombies coming out of City 17 have kept them pinned down. It's just a matter of time till the troops start pushing this way. If you're up to it, we'll let you out there. <laughs> He's always up for it. Oh, really? I'm always right, up Gordon? for it. Thanks for volunteering me, Alex. There's a door up here where I can let you over to the other side. That way you'll get to see the gun before it sees you. Sure. Let's take this trap door, then. Thanks. Also, why does that keep glitching? There's a graphical glitch if I ever saw one. Is that on a specific tile, or is that like when I... Yep, that's... Yeah, see, this is what I mean by props despawning. Things get weird. Okay, that was not even funner. Not, okay, it was, it was kind of fair. There we go. So this is kind of the stuff the dreams are made of. These, uh, these, these challenges here. There is nothing unsatisfying. Ooh. I was able to slice things in half here, but Jesus. Ah, shit. Ah, oh, damn it. There's a little Lamar running around. Heady. Now. Something tells me that this is a, uh, dangerous position for me to be in. Okay, I can hear things in there, and that is just terrifying as shit. Um... Oh, actually, I think I need to go up. Stay. Okay, that thing's dead now. So that's the auto gun there. 
That is a... Okay, I was kind of hoping I could break that open. Apparently I can't. Auto save. So I think what I need the most... Would have been one of these. Oh, shit. Head crabs, man, head crabs. This guide encounter is kind of uh, annoying to listen to, which is dead. And I know that, so I'm going to try and get through this as quickly as I can. Oh. Okay, are those things just, like, constantly spawning? Because this is, um, kind of worrisome. This is also, honestly, a little more terrifying than, like, Resident Evil. Like, can't go in there. Ooh. Oh, Jesus. This is not okay. This is absolutely... Shit. This is absolutely not okay. Getting that thing to fall over is the hard part. Just get me. Just get me. Oh! Okay. Well, fuck that fire. That was not okay. Not good. It's 
So I think I should be able to do this. That didn't work. That will. Oh, Jesus. There we go. You know, honestly, I think that auto gun is going to be more terrifying than... Okay, I didn't expect those guys to be there. Bitch. No. Okay, got my gnome. That is... Not of no importance. Okay, nothing back there. God, I am actually a little terrified of these guys. Okay. Oh my god, would you fucking s Stop. And now no more of you better spawn. Ooh. I don't know where the hell that came from. There we go. Okay, I'm holding con- Stop it. Oh my god, where are these things coming from? They weren't fucking there before. Jesus. Okay, I don't like the fact that I heard a whistle. Especially not when I have this little health. Holy shit. that sound. No. Oh 
ho, 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 I see them. No. Bad. Now I know you're down there. I do not want to flush out the grenade. You piece of shit. Ooh! There was another one of you assholes. Now something tells me you are the auto gun, so how do I break this? Maybe, just maybe. No? I am supposed to break this, right? I'm not going crazy. Well, that's grenades, so... There we go. That's a little better. Peace and quiet. Ain't nothing gonna destroy me now. This is how we do it. Now I say nothing gonna destroy me and then you watch. I'm gonna get destroyed like immediately as soon as I exit this. Now, these things, it feels like they continuously respawn. Let's test this. Well, not test it, but... Something tells me I need to make a mad dash back to the, uh... Sanctuary. Well, Alex, if you're just going to be there the whole time, that's just going to be helpful. Hey, Gordon, car's ready. Yeah, good, Come thanks. On, we'll get going. Sure. Thanks for clearing out the yard, Freeman. Heck of a job. Oh, I got to drive this again. I thought I was done with this. I really did. All right. The gnome in. Not only did they help me fix the car, they threw in a bonus. An extra gnome? Special this week only. It's like an onboard radar for you guys. Picks up little beacon jobbers like this one here. We've hidden a bunch beacon of jobbers. out there in the field to signal emergency stashes. Okay. So keep an eye out. When you see your dashboard light up, you're going to want to stop and investigate. Sure. I'll fill you in on the road, Gordon. How about I fill Thanks you in on the road? Guys. Oh, Alex, you do have a pistol, so you are going to shoot things, right? Go again. Yeah. Oh, 
fuck. Boom, that's how you kill them. You know you can... You just fucking get rid of my gnome. Day's work. But I just want Mr. Gnome to stay in the vehicle. There goes the radar. Oh, thanks. Okay, now that gnome should not have slid that far over, but okay. Cool, that's the radar. Whoa, Jesus Christ. What the hell is this? What the fuck is this raven? What are you doing? Okay, you know what? <clears throat> This raven's broken. Holy crap. So that thing lit up, okay. Ooh. So he mentioned that was going to be like a, a beacon thing. see anything up here, so we may as well hop back in the car. And... According to the radar, it looks like there's a supply cache here. That is true. The radar do say that. But is the radar lying, or is it for realsies? Can you help me find this, please? It must be this van. Oh, must it be? Oh, okay. I know what I need to do. Alright, fine. Geronimo! I guess you cleared up that little problem. Yes, I did. They use cold rings. Now. Okay, so that's a little beacon thing. Let's launch that. We don't need that. This one might need, though. Nope, I guess we don't. Cool. Well, it's cool to know that these supply caches exist. Ooh, saucy mix. Enough of that shit. Fuck off. I hate how long some of those things. No, I don't want to fucking hold on. Cool. But this gnome is my only supply cache that I need. 
I'm quick saving after this, which is the case again. You sound so happy, Alex. Like, I, I can't even be mad at you for being so sarcastically enthusiastic. Because honestly, same. There we go. And we'll clear up this little problem here. We don't need that. Yeah, the color of this box looks like... Oh! I think that is Magnum Condoms. Nope, that is Magnum Ammo. Same box color as the uh, the Magnum boxes. I know that one from experience. Um, level I like okay I hate the gnome in the car that is one of the biggest things that I have a problem with but genuinely I do enjoy the um, this car it handles a lot better than the uh, the one in half-life 2 base game Come on, Alex. Hi. Yeah. Part of me actually kind of wonders, like... I guess not only where White Forest is, but, um, I wonder how far it's going to be. Like, can I just walk there in the car? Do I need the car to get through some more swampy terrain? What what gives with that situ situation? Hey, something on the radar. Cool. Leave in the car. Now, do I go down the tunnel or do I go in here? Oh, yeah. Something tells me I'm going to want to nope out of something as soon as. whatever. Cool. Well, you told me it must have been the cache before. I'm assuming this one is this boarded up wall. Signal, but I don't see anything. What do you think, Gordon? Ah, oh, we'd never have known this was here without the beacon. Uh, I think I would have, because I would have picked up the saw blade. Ouch! What the fuck is going on with this shit? There we go. Uh -oh. I think the zombies want their stuff back. Oh, Jesus. Okay, I accidentally right-clicked that, and that was my fault. And I will take ownership of that. Oh, I forgot I have the crossbow. Oh, <laughs> right, doll. That's what I wanted to do with the gravity gun, was just break it open. That, that's all. But damn, this is, uh... Fuck, we got some flares, we got some... Rocket-propelled grenades, we got some health. Yeah, we got everything in here. 
Just come out of the ground? Cool if it did. Terrifying if it did, but cool. Save. I don't want to turn because of the no. Now, Alex, there is a light at the end of the tunnel. This time, I recommend not going toward the light like you tried to last time. Just getting that out there. Just, just, just saying. I also would uh, love if this game would load quicker. Oh, I know. Ooh. There goes the radar. Yeah, I just want to get the gnome back in. Now, I did not turn on the brake, I just exited the vehicle. By all means, this should be rolling downhill, and I'm glad it didn't. Okay, so it was just my imagination that I heard that. Okay. Could have swore I heard somebody talking on a walkie talkie. Nope, oh, shit, forgot about that. No. No, I would love to punt it across the map, but I have no idea where this map leads. So I'll just punt. Really? No? I swear to God. Stay. Nope. Something tells me that it's up on top of that cliff. Ooh, actually. I'll stay with the car. Yeah, okay, fine. I was gonna come back anyway. Tells me I must have missed a path somewhere. Or it's down under these rocks. Either way, I don't want to spend like two hours searching for a freaking ammo cache. This could be combine handiwork. Hard to be sure. Yeah, well, let's let's try. There are so many ways to die, you're not wrong on that. If I hop in the vehicle, how far back is that? It's pretty far back. Alex, why did you push the gnome out? Fuck off. Hey, you with me? No. I'm gonna quick save here. I'm gonna run back and see if I can find that ammo cache really quickly. I just wanna see if I can find it.
resist. Hey, Alex. Want a skeleton? You can put it in your closet. Let's bring the skeleton with us, too. Let's put him in the passenger seat. We'll just melt just to go and nom 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 nom. Um, okay, I have not had enough beer to. Whoops. To make jokes like this. I like how with the gravity gun I can pick it up, but not with anything else. There. Now we've got a skull skeleton decoration on our car. How does that sound, Alex? Better? Boom, baby! You can just not. This is a very desolate village. Alright, Alex. I don't care about the skeleton, but don't fuck with my gnome. Now let's have a quiet ride through the countryside. Just us as a couple. Just us. And the gnome. The gnome can watch. That sounded really weird out loud. Oh, the skeleton's gone. Stock up on this. Now, are we supposed to go forward? I knew it. I just realized there's a hunter there. Cool, that's great. Ooh, I got like a fire tip. Jesus. I think it is crossbow time. Alright, Alex, I appreciate you, but you need to learn to fend for yourself a little better. This is going to give me some spicy memories. Fuck. All right, we need to do this a better way. All right, reload. That's the time it is. Really? That's a fucking terrible place for you to fucking quick save me. Wow. I didn't even press quick save there. That, that was the game doing that. 
Oh, okay, I think I... Okay, man, what the hell? Yeah, I don't care, Alex. I mean, I kind of do, but I really don't. Don't get ahead of me. I have a heater and I'm gonna bring the heat. Thanks. Listen. Yes, they are. Oh shit, that, that was uh Oh. You know something right behind that wall and you're blocking me there, Alex. Okay, that's great, but the combine ran upstairs. I'm worried that I'm gonna like come around the corner and there's gonna be a hunter like in the lobby waiting for me. Oh, Jesus. Gordon. Speaking of. Oh, shit. That. God, these hunters are tough. Really? Because I just one shot at him. One shot him? This place is a death trap. Let's get out of here. I don't think we. Oh, he blocked it. Alex, get away from behind me. Holy fuck! Oh, it shit cocks! Holy Jesus Christ almighty, oh my god, please die. Three at a time. It's too much. Let's get moving before they send more. Of course, there's more of these assholes. Thanks. Now, the uh, the real question, Alex, that I need to ask is how do you expect us to get out of here? Something tells me Oh, I feel so... Oh, that is the White Forest Inn. Okay. You can get in the car. Well, let's find the power supply for this force field. Sure. Oh, crap. There was an HEV unit the whole time. Well, live and learn, I guess. Live and learn. Something tells me up there is the the uh the power wire unit. runs back up the hill to those buildings. Let's check those sheds at the top of the Sure, hill. let's do it. The level I mean, not sex. Uh well More of them coming. Crap. Uh, 
man, they really don't like us. Thanks, but I don't think it was. Yeah, that was a nice shot, and I'm not even going to lie about that. I'm proud of that shot. That was a really quick headshot. Take that turret down, Gordon. Would that I could. Oh, that did it. There's the power source for the shields. Huh. I haven't skimped on security either. Well, let me see if I can disable the shields and get you closer to the reactor. Thanks. Okay, it looks like I can open them from here, but I won't be able to come in with you. That's what she said. Here goes. <sighs> Sorry, Gordon. This thing's fried. Since I can't help you in there, why don't I stand watch outside while you disable the power cell? We've had enough surprises for one day. I mean, that's fair. But, um... How do you anticipate I do this, Alex? So I'm not gonna lie, I'm, I'm kind of... Wildly perturbed. Oh, wait, actually. Let's see. There is a, a little thingy my thingy up top. Ooh. So I can't get over there. I definitely misjudged that jump. Crap. Hold on, let me let me try this the uh, the easy way. I think I need to jump over the power shield. you dare. I'm also kind of curious to know why this barrel was able to come through without being destroyed, but I can't even just walk through. Oh, there's more crates. Uh... Okay, you need to stop. There we go. No. Physics. Am I right? <laughs> Physics. Maybe. Oh, yeah. Ooh, ammo. 
well too. This is how you do it. Puzzle if I ever saw one. There we go. There's still going to be. That should have done it. Let's go see if the force field. You already know it is. Let's hope there's no more combine between here and White Forest. Eh. Good. Nomi is still there. There we go. Uh, you're s sitting on the middle, I'm pretty sure. Yep, there it is. Oh, Jesus. Now this is the part I don't like. Road is blocked. Oh dear lord, no. Yeah. Sorry Alex, sorry for the bumpy ride. I see a fire down there, which either means it's a warning sign or oh, I can't know it's there. Good. Nope, it's just a car. I thought it was gonna be like a smoke signal or something to tell us that White Forest is uh... really. Now the ultimate question. I'll wait here. Thanks. Do I need to go this way or the other way? Well, obviously it's not this way because this is all blockaded off. Nope, cool. We're good. We're good. Well, that's not obvious. I don't know what is. See, this is how you explore. Um, F6. You mind if I wait in the car? Yes. But also, I thought the gnome was going to fly out, so. Oh, shit. Well, at least the gnome was was in the car. Get back in with Alex. And let's do this. 
Something tells me this is going to be a new episode. I'm kind of here for it, honestly. Or not a new episode, new uh, chapter. And that's okay, it happens. We want it to happen. We want to make sure these aren't two hours each. That doesn't sound good. No, it do not. Yeah, we're gonna need to go down here, Alex. I'm sorry. Over there, I see an antenna. Huh, I think that's White Forest. I certainly hope so. Well, we're close enough to make it rest of the way on foot if we have to. Which I think we will have to. Cool, let's do this, Alex. I would actually prefer going on foot. Yeah, um... Oh, dog, you're back! Ooh, one sec. Okay, I need a... This is gonna be a good freeze frame. Dog versus Strider? Oh man, this is great. Holy fuck, I love dogs even more now. I don't even like dogs. He's fine. He's faking. He's playing dead. He's doing a trick that you taught him as a kid. Oh, they're so adorable together. Everything working all right? You all right down there? We're fine. Is dog okay? Yes. Better now. We've been waiting for you. Just follow the stream, then head up the other side. White Forest is right there. You can't miss it. Thanks. All right. Thanks. Okay. Let's go. I mean, ideally, yes, let's go. Come on, Gordon. Get the car and we'll show us about. Oh, don't do this to me. Good boy. Looks like we need your help again. Would you mind? Would you stay in the fucking stop it? Gotta do it this way. That's better. Way to go, boy. Yes, way to go. Okay, dog. Race you to the base. <laughs> Step on it, Gordon. Sure, and let's hope the gnome doesn't fall out. Surprisingly, it has not. All right, the gnome fell out. There we go. I'll come back later for the uh, the, the dog challenge because apparently that is a challenge. Okay, would you just fucking stay in the goddamn car, gnome? Jesus. Just this time, though. Let us in. Yo, let him through. Thanks. 
The only reason Dog won that foot race is strictly because I had a gnome. Sure, there's nothing white about this forest except for the people here. That came out really wrong. Well, except for you, but... All right, white forest. Now, prepare for unforeseen consequences. Okay, you know what? There. So I don't have to hear the stupid hum. Oh no, what happened? Oh no. <laughs> the gnome. Just, just the gnome. Come on. Alex, the fuck did the gnome go? Dr. Freeman, you made no! It. Fucking my gnome! No! Don't you fucking get rid of my gnome. That is bullshit. Although, actually, now we can get Dog's race done and over with. Oh, I forgot about that. Yeah, we beat you. Now I gotta find the fucking gnome. <sighs> Crap. Well, something tells me the gnome fell off somewhere around the bottom here. You know, or I could just reload to save time. That would be, uh, that'd be much advised. Yeah, we're, we're just gonna reload to save time. That, that's just the best way to do it. Yeah, reload. You know what? You can just fucking hold the gnome next time. Did the gnome stay in? Oh shit, it did. I just wanted to get this done quicker. Is the gnome actually staying in the vehicle for once? Oh my god. I might have actually mastered this vehicle a little bit more. Does it get stuck on a fucking rock? You know, it's a good thing I don't get car sick. <laughs> oh, do you have any more things to say? You know, it is a good thing you don't get car sick, but um, based on how fast we go sometimes with this thing, I'm kind of wondering, do you get airplane sick? Now, get over here, Chomsky. That was honestly probably the dumbest cock-up of life. We had a feeling you were close when we saw a dog take off like that. Oh, yeah. Stupid fucking gnome. Anyway. Alex, can you get out from behind that tree, please? Are you, like, pissing up over there? Are you, like, are you squatting for a shit, or... Like, what are you doing? I understand you sometimes want to get closer to nature, but that is not the way. Just get that out there. Yes. Now this gnome better not despawn. Asshole gnome. There we go. Our mutual friend, Fiend. Alex. 
Yes, we did. Yes. Yes. What the f Just what the... F that gnome needs to not. Just, no. <laughs> uh, props don't despawn. I'm assuming that's because it was in the door. It wasn't actually... You know? It, it wasn't actually the gnome's fault. It was the location in which the gnome was when the video started. Chapter started. I'm assuming that's what caused it. Which I'm going to assume that's a programming error. Just getting that there, eh? But anyway, we're going to end this for now. We're going to come back to this later. Um, I pray to God that I don't have to deal with this vehicle anymore. Just getting that out there. I'm just, I'm hoping, I'm praying. Anyway. I swore more than I thought I would. But I also more less than I thought it would. I, like, that makes no sense out loud. Okay. I swore less than I normally do. So I swore less than I would expect if I do start swearing. But I thought I would be able to contain myself more. So I did swear more than I thought I would initially have sworn. That makes more sense. So, logically. Yeah. But hey. We're going to come back next time for our very best mutual fiend. And we are almost done Half-Life. Oh. Ooh. Ooh.